Hi everyone, it's Farmer Rob here from Cannon Hall Farm. Now we're at Bill Bedford's Shire Stud. We're here to collect Ruby, but while we're here, I'm going to have a catch up with one of my oldest, bestest friends. This is Will, and he looks to have grown a bit, and he's not even stood up yet. Um, I'm going to give him a back scratch for old times sake, but he looks in fabulous nick, and uh, I'm hoping he's pleased to see me. It's lovely to see Will again. Uh, we're going to get him out, we're going to have a proper talk to him and, uh, and see how he's come on. I'm sure he's done really well. And here he is. I'm just going to have a look at him. Oh, okay. How are you? Hey. You're looking well, aren't you? Do you want to scratch? Hey. Into back scratch. I'm really pleased with how he's grown. He's bigger than David now, which is a nice thing. Uh, he's looking really well, his coat's coming and uh, he's going to make an absolute cracker. When Will left the farm it was an upsetting day, but he's only down the road at York. I can visit him whenever I want and I've bumped into him three times since he left us and every time I think he's remembered me. We would love to have kept Will at Cannon Hall Farm, but he's going to be a stallion one day. He's going to be interested in all the mares. He would be difficult for us to contain. They've got all the facilities here. He's going to have a great life and hopefully cover loads of mares and pass his genes on down for generations to come. Good boy. Good. Good. Will has got really distinctive markings. That front left leg has got a heart on it, just like his mum and just like his older sister. It's obviously something in the genes and it makes them really special. Will was the first Shire Fall that we had born at Cannon Hall Farm and he'll always have a special place in our hearts. To see him just down the road in York, living his best life is magical. I'm really thrilled.